Hey everybody, Travis with Food Forest Abundance. And it's a wrap. We are, for the most part, finished. We accomplished this in three days. And wow, absolutely beautiful, absolutely amazing. We can do this in your home. But I'm gonna turn the camera around, we're gonna do a walkthrough, and you're gonna be able to see everything. Here we go, you're gonna love it. Look at that, all across the front there. And then we got the, look at that vineyard. Look at that, all them, six different types of grapes growing in here. Absolutely beautiful. And we're gonna go over to the, it's called uh, Medicine Spiral, I believe. I say circle, or I say sphere, I don't know, I didn't get it right. But check this out. Look at this. You can walk in here, look at that. You got your little bench over here to, if you want to meditate or whatever. Look at that. This area was overgrown with weeds and grass. And it's just, this whole thing was overgrown with weeds and grass. Just, and vines all over the fences with berries that are not edible. Uh, but look, look what we turned it into. And then in the back here, we have some raised garden beds that still have to be planted. So they're not, there's some watermelons in them, but this is all raised beds for annuals. So these are the ones that are planted in the spring normally. Everything else around here is uh, perennials. So once you plant them, they're in the ground and they grow forever. You know, if they live, you know, sometimes not every plant's gonna make it, but we give every plant the best opportunity to thrive. We use the best soils, the best mulches, and now we're going down to the food forest. And here we are. Look at this thing. There's food forest right here. We still, honestly, we have like 150 more plants to put in the ground before this job is actually complete. But for TV, we had to kind of get it done you know what I mean and here we are with the cantina how you doing good and got the little added skull I threw in there these are all succulents and cactus then we got Mexican olives Two Mexican olive trees right here in the entrance. They need a little bit of water. They just got put in the ground, so they're thirsty. We did water them already. And then this is where we are having our wrap party tonight, right here in the cantina. And uh, here you go. Look at that. This is what you can turn your property into by calling foodforestabundance.com. Or just email me, Travis, at foodforceabundance.com, and we will give you or get you install, design, and install the food forest of your dreams in your home, in your backyard, or if you have a lot of property. Look at this place; absolutely beautiful. Sorry, looking at this makes me emotional because of what we just did for this couple. They get to enjoy this for the rest of their lives. Well, that's a wrap. Now we get to have a wrap party, as they say in Hollywood. So uh, it's gonna be a fun night. But, and then tomorrow I drive back to Minnesota in the morning 
and get back about Friday about 2 a.m. But anyway, contact uh, Travis at foodforceabundance.com and we will design and install the food forest edible landscape of your dreams. Have an amazing night. Food forest everywhere.